entrepreneurship, whether in a societal context, a company context, has to be within boundaries. In fact, scholars have written about what's the difference between entrepreneurship and crooks. <laughs> if you think about it, you know, the mafia is pretty entrepreneurial. <laughs> But that's not what we mean by entrepreneurship. So what is left unsaid, and that's what the problem was with the financial sector in all these innovations. Nobody really asked important questions about the boundaries of innovation and entrepreneurship. So whether it's a, a societal context, whether it's a company context, there's always a set of rules within which entrepreneurship so, should operate. And in, in corporate entrepreneurship, which I've studied, the great companies, uh, for example, 3M that, uh, that uh, you know, Peter mentions, they have very clear rules about what you do not cross. You think of it like a ballpark within which you play. So you give you plenty of room to be creative and innovative, but some things you don't cross. And for, for example, one of those is integrity. One of those is cheating and lying. There's, there's, there's no excuse for that. So a simple few rules that uh, constrain what is acceptable behavior is needed.